Hey guys, I'm back again and I'm here with a little update on the read along of Bedrock Faith and I am going to do a pretty big giveaway here. Okay, so I hope Black History Month has been going very well for everybody, that they've been getting a chance to read more black authors this month. It's only the 8th of the month, so it's really the beginning, so it's never too late to try to pick up just a little something something. So let's start with Bedrock Faith. I've been carrying it around like this in the Ziploc bag to kind of keep it clean because I'm always out of the house for work at the moment. And so Bedrock Faith, we have read up to page 106 and we will now be reading up to page 214. So if you haven't joined the read along group over on Goodreads, I'll be sure to link that down below. The discussion seems to be going pretty well. I think some people have even already finished the book. Okay, so it seems like, uh, you know, people are enjoying it. I know I am. I'm, I'm pretty surprised. I wasn't really sure what to expect, but I'm pretty surprised with what we're getting so far. And it is pretty interesting and can get some discussion going. So that's all for Bedrock Faith. Now for the giveaways. The first giveaway is going to be of the book Tears We Cannot Stop by Michael Eric Dyson, A Sermon to White America, which I did a review on like uh, a week ago or something, 10 days ago. So I will be linking my video review and my blog post as well on this book. And St. Martin's Press has been kind enough to sponsor Hashtag Read So Lit this month and we'll be giving away a copy of this book. And it may even be signed if she can, you know, grab Mr. Dyson and get him to sign it. So it may or may not be signed, but you will definitely get a copy of this book. All you have to do is enter into the giveaway below by stating, I want tears we cannot stop. Okay, now the next giveaway is sort of like a giveaway and book mail. So I was contacted by Bookmasters and they proposed three different books for me to read and they specifically wanted me to review Heavenly Tidings from the Afrique Muse and that's this one right here which is a little bit of a chunker but yeah it's all right there's quite a lot of bibliography and stuff in the back but I'm about 50 pages in and it's like maybe 480 pages or something. But it's a book that focuses on Phyllis Wheatley. And basically what it does is it tries to clear up some misconceptions on what people think about Phyllis Wheatley or what they know about her life, that kind of thing. So I am so far, uh, like I said, 50 pages in and I'm quite enjoying it because I can't say I know that much about Phyllis Wheatley. But uh, I am learning things and quite happy to pick this book up. Now, they also gave me a book called Hemingway, Three Angels and Me by Jerome Mark Antill. And this is a fiction novel and it is geared towards a young learner. So I think it's middle grade to YA and it discusses life under Jim Crow. And I think this is a series, and this is actually book four in the series, but I don't think it matters if you haven't read book one, two, and three. I think they are each isolated or different subjects, historical subjects. And as you can see, it's written quite large. And what's really cool is there are pictures all the way through the book. Uh, so some pictures about World War II. And yeah, so I'm going to probably try to read this one as well, but not maybe not this month. I won't be able to get to it, but I'll try to read it next month. But it should be interesting and it's good for people that are interested in books that are geared towards uh, middle grade and YA, but they have a strong historical base to them. And the third book they gave me is this one. Long Road to Hard Truth, A Hundred Year Mission to Create the National Museum of African American History and Culture by Robert L. Wilkins. 
Okay, now, th I'm going to show you this picture. This is Robert L. Wilkins. He's a judge. He's a United States Court of Pe Appeals for the District of Columbia Circuit. And this is him right here. Okay, so this is a, it's a tiny little book, but I'm sure it's going to be full of some information and facts that I don't know that I should know. And it has some pictures and things in it of, you know, uh, some of the plans and give some more information so it's the kind of book that you kind of want to read to know more about the african-american museum so that's another one that bookmasters sent to me as well for book mail and now i'm going to get to the goodie is that bookmasters is also sponsoring hashtag read so lit this year and they have agreed to give away a book to three different people so you can put down below if you want to, you know, win one of the three. So that is either The Long Road to Hard Truth or if you want to read Hemingway, Three Angels and Me or if you want to win Heavenly Tidings from the uh, Africa Muse. So how I'll do this is that what you can do is you can just write below uh, I want to win everything. In which case, I will enter you in to each to each giveaway for the book, each book. And if you want to win specific ones, then you just tell me the titles that you want you would like to win. So everything will be listed below. So all of the titles and links, if I can find links to these books, um, will be below so that you can go and check them out. And I just want to thank again Bookmasters and St. Martin's Press for being kind enough to sponsor Hashtag Read So Lit which is, you know, trying to get people to read books by black authors, you know. So really cool that they decide to give these great books away. I hope that you are interested in winning these. If so, like I said, link it up below. I want it and you put whatever you want and it will, you know, we will run this giveaway. Now this giveaway will go until the 17th of February. So you have it until the 17th of February to state below what you want. Now what I'll do is to make it easier on you, I will number each book so that you won't have any difficulty, you know, putting down what you what you would like to be entered in to win. That's all I have for you today. I hope you all are doing well and that you are getting some reading done. Uh, at the moment, like I said, I'm reading this one, Heavenly Tidings, and I'm reading this one, Bedrock Faith. And I'm also reading The Sellout. I don't have it here. It's over there somewhere. So yeah, so I'm reading three books at one time. We will see. I'll probably, I don't know which one I'll finish first. Maybe the shortest, which is The Sellout, because it is really the shortest book of the three. But yeah, so I'm enjoying my Black History Month reading. It's just that my Black History Month reading has been very broken up because of my work. But I'm still hanging in there. And like I said, if you still want to join the Goodreads group, discussion group of Bedrock Faith, you're welcome to join. You just have to click the link below and I will honor your request. That's all I have for you today. Bye.